of these batteries. And what you do is you plug your USB cable into the battery, just like that. And the USB cable has a set of four connectors on it, and again just plugs straight into a 5 volt USB type port. We'll get those on the test machine and we'll see how they perform. Finally, 10 volts. 10 volts come with a covered USB charger, and in here we have normally four 10 volts, two are in use at the moment, four 10 volts with 2,775 milliwatt hours of power in them. And again, a micro USB style cable that plugs into a standard 5 volt USB port. We'll get these all on charge and we'll see how they perform. So during testing, it's a shame to know that one of these 10 volts decided it was going to stop working. Let's have a look. This one is producing a zero volts. And when we grab an EBL, 1.5 volts. And let's grab a Kratax, 1.5 volts. So Kratax seem to be holding up. 